Thomas, you've signed a, a new contract at, at Blues. Uh, tell us your thoughts about that, please. Yeah, um, very excited, um, very happy to, to, to sign a new contract and uh, stay in the club for longer. Um, last two years was was good for me. Uh, you know, um, I'm, I'm, I feel like uh, you know I feel like home, and uh, I'm you know I really appreciate the chance to stay longer. And the end of this season, I don't think any of us expected to turn out how it did. But you got over the line, so there's a great relief there. But also, I guess a sense that let's make sure that we're not in that situation again. Yeah, as I said, the uh, last two seasons was good for me. I mean, you know, uh, the last six months particularly was tough uh, for everyone, not just me, my colleagues, team colleagues, uh, the whole club, the fans, you know. We put ourselves in really difficult position, which we really shouldn't be. Uh, but uh, I think the last three games particularly uh, show that, you know, we are better as we, we've been this last six months, you know, we, we play very well last three games and, uh, you know, very compact. Uh, uh, we stay up, uh, which was difficult because, uh, you know, uh, we put ourselves in position where everything could happen. Uh, even smallest mistakes of each of us of players could cost the, everyone, the club, the fans, everyone, you know, really a lot. But, uh, you know, the last three games uh, was fantastic. And I think, uh, you know, we are like this last three games, you know, very close game against Villa. We didn't deserve to lose, uh, you know, uh, last, then the Huddersfield playing 10 man, Miss Penanti still won the game, massive game with great support. You know, the, f the, the whole stadium, the, it was unbelievable experience. And the uh, final game, you know, 1-1-0 one, on one, the massive pressure. Even the goalkeeper went in a few times and tried to, you know, had the ball. And this is the beauty of English football, you know. And uh, we survive. And uh, I think uh, next season going to be uh, different. Like you said, you know, I hope never going to happen again. There was something which I never uh, had in my uh, whole career. And uh, I think it's never going to happen. What was the pressure and the tension like of those last three games, in particular the last game at Bristol City? Yeah, it was massive, you know, uh, we knew it, we need to win and uh, we knew it, we, you know, we can rely on, on nobody and the, the pressure was enormous. You know, it's different if you got the pressure to go to the final, to, to fight for something or, or, or fight for like Premier League, you know, you want to go there, but OK, if not happened, then, you know, that's it, you try next year. But to, to be in the position where you have to survive to stay in the, in the, in the league. Uh, it's, it's massive, you know, it's, it's, it's very difficult and the football is, is, is it's a funny game sometimes, you know, you, you, you could, you could uh, easily lose with one, one small mistake and then go down and then we would be really sad now and uh, I think uh, uh, last three games, like I said, we did well and I hope never going to happen. And yourself, you're a contender for player of the season this season, is there more to come from you? Yeah, it's a difficult one to be honest because I conceded so many goals this season, and uh, you know uh, was was tough for me. You know I don't I don't like that, and I don't, no one goalkeeper like that. But you know I really appreciate uh, you know the opinions and the, the you know people vote on me and they 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 they, they saw the good side of it as well. Even I conceded these all goals, and I think uh, you know it was a great thing to be mentioned. Simple like that, and. Um, yeah, I appreciate that. And what do you think the team can achieve next season, all being well with everything, you know, going the right way? Uh, it's that to be boring, but uh, you know, the last three games, particularly because we're not going to go back to like a few months, but last three games showed everyone that you know we could easily be uh, you know fighting for something more as just mm -hmm. surviving and. Uh, you know, uh, the squad was fantastic, uh, you know, uh, the, the, the last, you know, the, the, the new management which came to the club and, you know, sorted everything very quick out and the tactic and, uh, you know, uh, 
the happiness came back straight away and the way how we trained, the way how we approached the game and the, the confidence which uh, we got from, from uh, our manager you know, uh, and the staff. And, um, you know, this is, this is what, what, what we need and uh, I think we can uh, easily, you know, next season keep going like that and then fight for something more, but we will see what happens. Just finally, goalkeepers are renowned for their longevity. So how long are we going to see you out there for then? How many more seasons do you think you've got left in you? Oh, I hope uh, many, many still, but uh, realistically, uh, you know, I'm 35 now. I feel, uh, I feel good, I feel fit and uh, still hungry. And, you know, uh, definitely two years, uh, Birmingham, maybe three, we'll see. And uh, this is what is on the, on the contract, but... Uh, I hope longer. Why not? I mean, you know, uh, I like I like to be committed, and I like this club. I like this place. I like training ground. I like the club, the, the the fans, and the stadium. Everything. I hope I I could stay longer. Why not?